How's it going everyone? Um, so in this video, I'm going to talk about the secret to losing weight and feeling great. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999. So the secrets to losing weight. I will start off saying right now that um, a month and a half ago, I reached the peak of my bulk. I got to 208 pounds. Again, I'm only 5'9", so that was pretty heavy for me. Built up a lot of muscle. And I am on, for the last month and a half, I have been losing weight. So I went from 208, and today I weighed in at 192. So a month and a half, I've dropped 16 pounds. Now, a lot of people, they would be like, whoa, I just want to lose 5 or 10 pounds. You lost 16 pounds. How, how can you do that? Um, the secret to losing weight is extremely simple. It can get a little bit difficult if you don't follow a few tips, but the secret to losing weight, and I'm gonna explain this to you really, really, really simple. The secret to losing weight is consuming less calories than your body needs currently. So right now your body needs a certain amount of calories to maintain itself. Chances are, it's if you're a guy, probably about 2,500 calories. Again, if you don't work out, you don't lift weights, chances are 2,500 calories. Now, what would happen is if, if you need 2,500 calories to maintain your weight, what would happen if you ate 2,000 calories? What would happen is you would not get enough calories for the day. And what would happen is your body would use your extra fat as energy to keep you alive. Survival. So what'll happen is if you keep eating 2000 calories, your body is going to keep using your fat storages as energy. So what happens is you lose weight. It's literally very, very simple. And that's what I've been doing for a month and a half. I require 3,500 calories to maintain my weight. So for the last month and a half, every single day, I just hit 3000 calories. I mean, I, that's what I've been doing for the last 13 years. I've Usually I do a bulking cycle, nine or 10 months, and then I do a cutting cycle, two to three months. I've been doing this for 13 years. I don't do anything fancy when I lose weight. I literally pick a calorie target, I hit that calorie target, and I just do that for two to three months, and I lose anywhere from 20 to 30 pounds. Like, I got up to 208, I'm probably gonna get down to about 175. Maybe 180, but probably 175. So about 33 pounds I'm gonna drop. Probably take me about three months. So I've done it a month and a half, probably another month and a half. Um, the next bulking cycle, I'm probably only gonna get up to 190 and then again, drop back down to 175. A lot of the stuff that people look at for losing weight, it really has no effect on their body. Like different diet, you can pick any diet you want, any diet, it does not matter the diet. If you need 2,500 calories to maintain your weight and you hit 2,000, you could do keto, Mediterranean, high protein, low carb, high carb, low protein. You're going to lose weight. It's, it's as simple as that. And people make weight loss extremely confusing. Now, a little tricky part about losing weight is the hunger. Here's the thing that you have to understand about hunger. When you first start losing weight, so again, I needed 3,500 calories to maintain weight. I started eating 3,000. The first three days of cutting weight, losing weight is the hardest because what will happen is your body will get a little bit hungry because you're not giving it enough nutrients. If you can get past about three days of losing weight, after that, it is super easy. I don't even get hungry anymore. A lot of times when I'm losing weight, again, I need 3000 calories to lose weight. It'll be like nine o'clock at night. And I'll only have ate like 2,400 calories. I'm like, no, I have 600 calories to eat. So a lot of times I'm actually forcing myself to eat food. And again, I, I lose weight super, super easy because I'm hitting that calorie goal. How do you feel good when losing weight? I feel amazing all the time losing weight. Why? because I'm only reducing my calories by a very small amount. If I need 3,500 calories to maintain my weight and I'm eating 3,000, 500 calories really isn't that much. So I'm doing a very small caloric deficit. For people who don't track their calories, people who don't weigh their food, 
If you need 2,500 calories to maintain your weight and you're not tracking your calories, what could happen is you may only be eating 1,000 calories per day, and that's definitely possible. So your calorie deficit might be 1,500 calories, and I've seen this before with people. People have told me what they're eating on their diet. I've calculated everything up, and they actually needed like 2,000 calories to lose weight, and they were eating about 800 calories in a day, and they felt terrible. Yeah, because you're not eating enough calories. That's why tracking your food is so important. So you're just in a slight caloric deficit. That, that's what makes losing weight very easy. Tracking your calories, weighing your food makes things so much easier. When I'm losing weight, I try my best not to eat foods that I don't know the calorie amounts for. So foods like this would be anything mixed together. So stir fries terrible for losing weight because I don't know the calories because again, you'll have rice, maybe chicken, maybe veg, everything mixed together. Yeah, you could weigh that. You just pick everything apart and you weigh like eight different things, but who wants to do that? Um, eating takeout food at restaurants that aren't big chain. So if you eat at a restaurant such as Tim Hortons, McDonald's, Subway, all of those big companies have nutrition info on the internet, if you're eating at small, small restaurants, like family owned, they're not going to have nutrition levels probably on the internet. So you have no idea how many calories you, you are eating. That is the only thing I stay away from when I am losing weight. I stay away from foods like that, foods that I have no idea what I'm eating. So that's what I recommend. End of video. Thank you so much for watching.